Hey everybody, Walker here. In this video, I'm going to go over the new games that are being added to Game Pass from mid-August right up until the end of the August. We're also going to cover the games that are leaving Game Pass as well, so if you're halfway through them, you'll have plenty of notice and be able to finish them before they leave the service. If you enjoyed the video, like the video and subscribe to see more, and also leave a comment and let me know which of these games you're looking forward to playing the most, if any. Hope you enjoy the video. Let's jump right in. The first game, which is available now on Game Pass for the PC, is Microsoft Flight Simulator. From light planes to wide body jets, fly highly detailed and accurate aircraft in the next generation of Microsoft Flight Simulator. Test your piloting skills against the challenges of real-time atmospheric simulation and live weather in a dynamic and living world. The world is at your fingertips. The next game, which is also available now, is Spirit Vera. Learn how to say goodbye in this cozy management game about dying. Playing as Stella, the Spirit Vera, build a boat to explore an imaginative world in search of spirits seeking passage to the afterlife. Befriend and care for your passengers as you farm, mine, fish, harvest and cook and craft your way across mystical seas of your handcrafted ferry. Run, jump, zip and glide your way through elegantly constructed platforming levels. Bring along a friend to join the fun as Daffodil, the cat, in optional two-player local co-op. Spend relaxing quarter time with us spirit passengers. Create lasting memories and ultimately learn how to say goodbye to your cherished spirit friends. The next game, which will be available on August 20th, is Battletoads. The wait is over. Rash, Zitz and Pimple are returning at last to smash the, their way through an all-new action-packed adventure of choreographical chaos. And Couch Court may never be the same. One to three players will take control of the Battletoads and team up, storm through and wild unpredictable stages with only one rule, expect the unexpected. Teamwork makes the dream work in the drop in and drop out gameplay blast filled with over the top gameplay moments that anyone can enjoy, but only a true toad can master. The next game, which also comes on August the 20th, is Crossing Souls. It's 1986 in California. A group of friends will live the summer of their lives after a mystic, mysterious discovery in the woods outside their quiet town. By uncovering an artifact whose powers they don't fully understand, these remarkable kids will defy the laws of nature and somehow interact between two planes of reality. Life and death. Their curiosity will trigger a series of unexpected events that will get them involved in a government conspiracy and a mysterious US Army general with his own nefarious plans. The next game that's also coming August 20th for the PC is Darksiders Genesis. Darksiders Genesis is an action adventure game that tears its way through hordes of demons, angels and everything in between. On its way to hell and back, with guns blazing and swords swinging, Genesis gives players their first look at the world of Darksiders before the events of the original game. Furthermore, it introduces the fourth and last horseman, Strife, as well as co-op gameplay for the first time in the history of the franchise. The next game, which also comes on August the 20th, is Don't Starve Giant Edition for both console and PC. Don't Starve Giant Edition is an uncompromising wilderness survival game full of science and magic. You play as Wilson, an intrepid general scientist who has been trapped by a demon and transported to the mysterious wilderness world. Wilson must learn to exploit his environment and, his, and its inhabitants if he ever hopes to escape and find his way back home. Don't Starve Giant Edition includes the original hit game Don't Starve and the Reign of Giants expansion, which adds new playable characters, seasonal bosses, weather conditions, new biomes, creatures and more. The next game coming on August 21st is New Super Lucky's Tale. Join Lucky on his thrilling journey through the Book of Ages, a magical artifact that opens doors to amazing worlds. Meet new friends, explore exciting lands, and recover the missing pages from the evil sorcerer Jinx and his villainous family. The dreaded Kitty Litter, a complete reimagining of the original Super Lucky's Tale, with new content and improved story and major overhauls to the camera and player controls. New Super Lucky's Tales is the definitive Lucky experience and a love letter to the classic 3D platformer. The next game, which will be coming on August the 27th, is Hypnospace Outlaw. 
Hypnospace Outlaw is a 90s internet simulator in which you scour Hypnospace's wide variety of weird and wonderful websites to hunt down wrongdoers, while also keeping an eye on your inbox, avoiding viruses and adware, and downloading a plethora of apps that may or may not be useful. In your spare time, you can customise your Hypno OS desktop however you see fit, with a variety of downloads, wallpapers, screensavers, and helper bots to keep you company. Also coming on August 27th is Tell Me Why, Chapter 1. Tell Me Why is the latest narrative adventure from the Don't Not Entertainment, the studio behind beloved franchise Life is Strange. In this intimate mystery, twins Tyler and Alison Ronan use their supernatural bond to unravel the memories of their loving but troubled childhood in a beautifully small town, Alaska. The next game, coming August 28th, is Double Kick Heroes. Double Kick Heroes mixes a shoot 'em up with a rhythm game. In story mode, you must survive on the highway to hell by killing monsters with your Guadillac. Struggle through the 30 levels of total madness and escape from the nightmare. Only the power of metal can save your band. In arcade mode, jump right into the action and play your favourite tracks from the game. It features Double Kick Zombies in the face and insane metal music. Also coming on August 28th is Wasteland 3. Wasteland 3 is a squad-based RPG from InXL Entertainment featuring challenging tactical turn-based combat and a deep reactive story full of twists, turns and brutal ethical decisions that will keep you hooked. Whether you're a Wasteland veteran or a new to the series, create a squad of up to 6 ranges and customise them with perks and abilities geared for your playstyle. The next game, coming September the 1st, is Crusader Kings 3 for the PC. The grand strategy game puts you at the head of a noble house in a deeply researched medieval world. Use your armies, your diplomacy and your wit to expand and elevate your dynasty. Each generation brings new characters and new challenges, as pesky plotters, turbulent priests and ungrateful children challenge your efforts to keep your realm and your family in line. The next game, which will come on September the 3rd, is Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Menace and desperation seethe through the rotted walls of the abandoned southern farmhouse. Resident Evil 7 Biohazard marks a new beginning for survival horror and a shift to the immersive first-person perspective. Powered by the RE engine, graphics reach new heights with incredible photorealism to further draw players into the disturbing game world. And that's it. That's all the games that are being added to Game Pass from mid august to the beginning of september now leaving game pass on august 31st for the console and pc is creature in the well guiana sister twisted dreams metal gear solid 2 and 3 metro last light redux and the jackbox party pack 3 then leaving game pass on september 1st is nba 2k20 and finally, leaving Game Pass on September the 7th is Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, I know a lot of you will probably be playing Red Dead Redemption 2 now, so you've got just short of three weeks to finish that off if uh, you know you want to do that. Or if you end up buying the game, you get a discount when it's still on Game Pass as well. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, consider liking and subscribing to see more. And don't forget, leave a comment. And let me know which of these games you're most looking forward to playing. Wookie out.